There you go. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yes, good afternoon. Bago natin pag ang Asus products, I have a question for you. What is just like one line or one thing that makes Asus different from all of the other products and why should they go so, for it? Dapat alam mo yan. Quiz yan, quiz. RGB, RGB. RGB. RGB number. Incredible. Kakaiba sila. Yes, and I'm going to talk about that. Okay. Okay, mga kuya. Today, oh, si Kuya Patrick, si Kuya Nico. Si Kuya Nocom po yung nasa stage, hindi ko makita. Basta nandyan siya somewhere. Pinag-uusapan niya yung mga produkto ng... Hi, ma'am! Gano'n kayo? <laughs> Pinag-uusapan niya yung mga produkto ni Asus. Oh. Ano nasa try naman na po ako? Kamusta po kasi sa late eh. <laughs> Ayun po. So, uh, may pinapakita na yung mga products dito. Some, uh, I think the public can actually look around and check out some of their products. So, cool. We're in the middle of Trinoma Activity Center if, you're, if you still haven't figured that out. But that's what we're doing right now. Right, so, it looks like you can uh, actually try, test and try some of the uh, Asus laptops here. So, you would uh, normally expect some of the events. You can check out their laptops. Uh, they also have desktops, of course. They have, you know, you can buy their components or you can buy full systems from Asus. Um, but the one that they have here, I think, is the GL503, which should be new and should be interesting for a lot of consumers. It's actually quite affordable. I think 75K is the uh, the 7700HQ variant. Oh yes, and we have a booth tawag ni Kuya Nico is consumer notebooks but it's more it's more like tawag ko lang sa kanya non gaming notebook eh. Nagsiali sa mga mga tao kasi nagde-demo si Ate sa kanilang programa. Hello. Hello. Oh, nagilo si Ate sa akin. Oh, it's a flip. This is the VivoBook S15. Oops, sorry. The ZenBook 3 looks good. That's the Flip S. Kamo ka ata no. Now we have the VivoBook VivoBook 14. There you go. All right, mga kuya, sandito na yung bagong endorser ni Asus. Uh, the uh, Asia's winner of Next Top Model, and she's a Filipina. Uh, it's uh, Maureen Robowitz. Um, so she's talking about the Zenfone 4 series right here, so you can see that. And for everyone, the people bought this one of the most prestigious and 18 dollars we had. So it's actually thin, but it's also super important. So can you give? We also have actually a Christmas before. Oh, it's so bright! Okay, there we go. Photo off. Photo off. Let photo off. Number one. December. Kaya na bago. Test na number one. Kaya na bago yung pangalan nila sa Wikipedia. Kaya tao ba? Hindi. Yes. Number one. We're also doing. Kaya wala. 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 Nas uh, P2P bus na tayo and uh, we're headed to uh, 
Makati, right? Uh, katapos na yung ASUS event. I thought there was gonna be a press release na pwede natin basahin afterwards, but uh, it was not. So, uh, yun yung kanilang uh, little demonstration there. You can go to uh, Trinoma Activity Center. I don't know eh, kung hanggang kailan yung kanilang roadshow. It could be just today. But anyway, that's their uh, promo for today. They announced the uh, the new endorser, si uh, Maureen Robowitz. Starts with a W, so... There you go. Also, An Mateo for the gaming side is there. I uh, just want to mention the Asus GL503 Strix Scar and Hero editions are actually pretty good. Asus is ridiculously competitive right now with their 75k laptops, uh, gaming laptops. So that's what I said. Tapos na yon, but as far as we can tell, uh, you know, since we're here, na let's talk about the new uh, P2P bus stuff. Um, there's now LCD on each seat. I'm not necessarily sure kung gusto ko yung pwesto ng LCD. I'll show you. Nung una kong nakita sa mga photos ito, I thought, you know, you could move the LCD arm. You know, move it forward or backwards. But no, it's it's pretty much fixed vertically up like that. So, kung papasok ka sa upuan, you have, you have the choice of going to the left of it. Doon ka papasok sa eskinita doon. Or ipapasok mo yung paa mo doon sa, ano, doon sa butas dito. And then, sushoot ka pa ganun. I don't know. I don't know why they designed it that way. I mean, okay lang naman. May LCD na tayo. So, LCD. I, I got more comments. So, LCD right here. Ito nyo naman. It actually, kung ayaw mong matakpa, maano, ma, ma, ma-obstruct yung, yung corridor mo, you have to move it like this. So, paganito, paganyan, right? So, ang problema, yung shoulder mo, matama siya doon. So, kailangan yung shoulder mo, nasa loob na yun, nitong area na to. So, makita mo dyan. But, if you, you can move it, oh God! <laughs> For a big guy like me, this is pretty hard. So, here's your LCD right here. Obviously, this is uh, some sort of Android tablet. Um, press home. Uh, may mga partnership sila dito to get content into this thing so you can actually watch stuff do stuff uh, probably best to just keep your own cell phone but in a LCD may LCD din sa kaliwa if you want but yes I think may headphone jack yan and I don't know I think may may charging port somewhere I don't know but kung gusto mo ng space you move it the obstruct mo yung corridor since wala rin pag after umalis naman ng P2P sa kanyang Depo, hindi naman siya hihinto, so just move it away. And now you have this little pole next to your thigh, which hindi mo pwedeng igalaw. But at least your shoulder can go into the corridor a little bit. Wala lang, just minor stuff about the, uh, the LCD thing. Dati wala yan, but uh, I mean, a lot more people are probably liking that than not. So, K. Okay. So if you want to see other features, as you can see, well, hindi kasali yung sa features natin. That's electric fun. <laughs> uh, if you want to see other features, actually, the, the one of our fellow YouTubers, uh, youtube.com slash gadget addict has covered a lot of the P2P buses before and he's seen this before. But as you can see, there is a place you can, this is a handlebar lang pala, hindi pala siya sabitan ng bag. These are yung sabitan mo ng bag. And this is a place to put a, a cup holder basically. And actually meron kang food tray uh, generally just put a if you want you can put a laptop in there there we go uh, it's a baba siyang ah wait paano siyang gamitin oh high tech okay and then huh sorry hindi ako high tech hindi ko maintindihan paano siyang gamitin anyway that's the food tray I don't think anybody needs to use that and then meron kang little pocket right here and then also a footrest down here there you go so, as you can see, maluwag siya. Um, most P2P buses are very maluwag, and of course, you control your own air con. And uh, it's 17.39, so it's 5.39 in the evening, in the afternoon. We're just passing by Trinoma on the way south. So, hopefully, makarating tayo sa Makati within, within like an hour or so. But, kung oh, traffic, the fare right now is 75 pesos. So, it's 20, 20 pesos more than previous fares. But that's actually, you know, sobrang sulit na yung 75 na yun kung tutuusin. Okay mga ako 
my uh, I want to show you my uh, top secret way of reclining dito sa P2P bus. Basically, what you do is you turn yourself sideways like this, raise your foot like this, and now you're reclining sideways. You have more space. Nakataas yung paa mo, and you're uh, you're pretty happy. <laughs> Okay, mga kuya, nandito tayo sa Glorieta and uh, with the bus took about, I would say, about an hour and 20 minutes. It's uh, 6.50 right now. So, mga uh, 1 hour 20 minutes. Uh, yeah, basically. So, I don't like the LCDs. It, it really takes up so much space in your elbow room. And then, think about yourself slamming against those LCD screens once you try to squeak squeeze into one of the chairs it's crazy it's really really pag paglabas ko talaga na, nararamdaman ko natutula ko yung yung, yung, uh, yung pole pataas ng LCD screen so that thing i don't know maybe not gonna last a while but it really disrupts the flow and then and feeling of the uh, the actual bus and sinubukan ko yung yung window seat where the display is to your left. There are some window seats on nasa gitna, pagitan nyo, but there is a window seat na nasa display mo. Sobrang, your, your left elbow is, your, or your, wherever your window side is, sobrang sinira nung, nung LCD because it, obviously, it disrupts your, uh, your field of vision as well. So, oh God, I don't know about that LCD, man. It's, it's this, really is kind of, you know, as a tourist bus, it kind of dis really destroys that aesthetic. But, you know, there's probably a sponsorship deal with that. Um, looks like Uber just gave me a notification. Now, last time I book, and that's going to be the struggles for today.